Hey everyone. What's up guys, unofficial MCU here. Hope you're all doing well, and in this video we have a new update regarding Deadpool 3, Deadpool and Wolverine. We have some new reveals about multiple Deadpool variants appearing within the movie itself. Of course, we're gonna go ahead and break it all down for you guys from everything that we're hearing from the rumor mill right now in today's video. Before we do though, however, grab that subscribe button if you haven't already, as we're discussing and covering all types of Marvel-related news, leaks, rumor theories, and breakdowns here on the channel. So if you guys are into any of that, go ahead and grab that subscribe button today. Okay, so in this video, we are going to be taking a quick read from GiantFreakinRobot.com. I'll have their article linked in the description down below for you guys to check out there as well as an overall garnering source there as well. Since the first official trailer for Deadpool and Wolverine dropped last month, or Deadpool 3, fans have been giddy speculating of what could be awaiting for us when the film actually arrives in theaters on July 26. One of the most important bits of information to come from the premiere teaser was that the Time Variance Authority, or the TVA, better known as from Loki on Disney+, Plus, first introduced in the MCU in Loki, would be playing a big part in the threequel, and amid those different rumors circulating around about the TVA, seems to be correct. Now, a new piece of promo art is showcasing and circulating around a multitude of Deadpools, or Deadpool variants, which may prove to be quite the headache for his sidekick Wolverine. So we have a plan for uh, of different Deadpools appearing within the movie. In the poster, we see the latter half of the heroes in Deadpool and Wolverine stand strong with his classic suit with his claws drawn. Below him are five Deadpools with four appearing to be different variations of the one standing in the middle, the original Deadpool, as would be taken. The lineup includes a baby pool, a presumed teenage pool, dog pool, who we knew would be appearing in the film already from official promos coming from Ryan Reynolds, and some sort of bodiless Deadpool propelled by a set of chopper blades affixed to his head. There are also different but yet also familiar. If Wolverine thought that the original Deadpool was as annoying as they would come, he can almost be guaranteed that he's in for a brutal headache when he meets these different variants, specifically Teenage Pool, who's sure to be driven by spite and angst. We'd presume that the bodiless Deadpool would also be a real pain in the neck for X-Men members as the cruises around on his blades of glory in Deadpool and Wolverine. I found this one way too interesting just not to talk about here on the channel. It seems to be leaked and kind of circulating around on various platforms such as X or Twitter and on Instagram as well. So I wanted to go ahead and show you guys here as well. Anyway, let me know what you guys all think in the comments down below. Thanks so much for watching today's video. Of course, this has been an official MCU. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Have a great one. Peace out.